is on Tiawa, by Shemi Habashai, Bahara Karkadash. And double honors onto the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. I want to see brothers out there on the highways and the byways teaching this word in all sincerity and in truth. And, um, you know, this is just an example of why the scriptures say what it says, man. A lot of you, Jake, you don't get it, man. This is Sarat 12 and 10. It says, never, never trust thine enemy for like as iron rust if so if his, is his wickedness, man. And, uh, and lying and the breaking of covenant, the breaking of your word is wickedness, man. And that's the nature of Esau Edom, man. Mankind wicked and evil. <laughs> if you didn't know, now you know. Now a lot of you might be saying, oh, well, the, the so-called white man's not my enemy. Well, if we go to Deuteronomy, the 28th chapter and the 68th verse, it says quite clearly, if you want to identify who your enemy is, Deuteronomy 28, 68, and the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again with ships by the way whereof I spake unto thee, thou shalt see no more again, and there ye shall be sold unto your enemies for bondmen and bondwomen, and no man shall buy you. So my question to you is, what people were you sold to? Because those are your enemies, man. And they're still your enemies to this very day. Alright? Now, let's have a closer look at this. This It says, this is from Ling, Ling Huang Zhao, okay? Go, Chinese government official. Alright? He says, not an inch. This is a quotation now. Not an inch of NATO's present military jurisdiction will spread in an eastern direction. Okay? Okay? 